all YouTubers to subscribe and thank you for watching this YouTube video. So I want to talk about the mainstream and alternative media who I believe are basically the same thing, it's just lipstick on a pig basically. So have you ever heard the expression that if you want to get on with somebody you have to you know, make yourself not look like a loser? And uh, one way, especially with the opposite sex, they give you the advice of, well, you, you must keep them waiting. <laughs> it's, a, it's a terrible idea. Uh, so, you know, they say, you know, when you respond to them, don't respond straight away. Okay. Okay, well, it, it depends what you mean by that, because uh, they usually say, well, I make them wait for a week. I mean, well, if you're a millionaire, with a lot of clout behind you and a world champion box and stuff like this then maybe you can do that uh, but most men <laughs> most men if they did that uh, by the time you respond uh, you know you, that that opportunity is gone another thing is if you did that on the dating site let's say you're responding to people on online and you just make them wait you say I, I have to make this person wait 12 hours and 53 seconds whatever it, whatever it is um, by the time you come back to that person it's already too late right so that is a problem and what I mean by this is if you want to make friends with somebody both in a romantic or in a friendship way don't play fucking stupid games with them and if you go play stupid games you go win no prizes or you go win stupid prizes and I think a lot of the reason why the alternative and mainstream media you know tell you things like this and you know social distancing wear masks don't go to your nans don't meet up with people and all this remember all that is down to one thing they want you to be isolated because it's called divide and conquer they also do not want lots and lots of kids in the world so one way of doing that is to make sure social distancing keep away from each other don't talk to each other wear a mask keep yourself silent stuff like that and when you do that then you can never ever ever meet with somebody and if you keep a person waiting let's say in a romantic setting for you know even you know a day or whatever or let's say like five hours by the time you get back to that person that opportunity that you may have had has already floated away now granted people can't just you know be online all the time or they can't be available to everybody all the time but it's like they say for instance with a woman for instance if she's interested in a man she'll make time you know? and by the way most people have mobile phones around with them all the time nowadays so the chances are that most people have already seen your message by the time you actually typed it out it's just one of those things it's the way it is the world today so don't listen entirely to what people actually tell you online because some of the motives behind this you know might be darker than you can ever imagine and you're not being given good advice um, of course yeah I mean even I am trying to make it you know I don't call it a bad version of myself I call it a new metamorphosis right but yeah a, a better version of yourself is actually still a good idea um, and that's what we all should try to accomplish and it's things I want people watch my videos and people I know in real life both online and uh, in real life I want them to actually do well in what they do because I want the world to be a better place basically and at the moment, you know, bad things have been happening over the last three years where the media and governments have really taken advantage of the population, even lied to them quite a lot. Um, anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye for now. I hope, you know, you take some of that on board. And it doesn't necessarily mean that, you know, you, you're always available to somebody. It's just don't play fucking stupid games with people, especially, you know, these millionaires, etc. I mean, something like... Uh, Andrew Tate, he, he can afford to do that, but if you play that type of stupid game with somebody, the chances are that opportunity is already floated by. The reason why it might work for him is because he's a millionaire, and also a lot of these people who do that stuff 
have very, very short relationships, very short, which means they never make true friends because they're never available for that person. And the person just says, fuck you, I'm not interested anymore, right? And this whole thing about bad boys as well, that's, that's questionable and I need to make a different video about that. But anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye for now. See you later.